Hi, and welcome to Stories of the Saints. On February 10th, we celebrate the feast day of Saint Scholastica. Saint Scholastica, sister of Saint Benedict, consecrated her life to God from her earliest youth. After her brother went to Monte Cassino, where he established his famous monastery, she took up her abbot in the neighborhood of Plumbaralia, where she founded and governed a monastery of nuns about five miles from the St. Benedict's, who it appears also directed her as a sister. She visited her brother once a year and she was not allowed to enter his monastery. It went in company with some of his brethren to meet her at a house some distance away. These visits were spent in conferring together on spiritual matters. On one occasion, they had passed the time as usual in prayer and pious conversation, and then in the evening, they sat to take the reflection. Saint Scholastica begged her brother to remain until the next day. Saint Benedict refused to spend the night outside the monastery. She had recourse to prayer and furious thunderstorms bursted out near the Saint Benedict's nor any of his companions could return home back to the monastery. So they spent the night in spiritual conference and in the next morning they departed different ways. Three days later, Saint Scholastica died and her holy brother beheld her soul in a vision and she had ascended into heaven. He sent his brethren to bring her body to his monastery and laid it in the tomb he had prepared for himself. She died about the year 543 AD and Saint Benedict followed her soon after. Her feast day is on February 10th. If you like this video about Saint Scholastica, please press the like button. And if you'd like to learn more about the saints, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you want to become a premium member and watch cinematic movies about the saints, you can go to thechristianchannel.com and support us by subscribing to our yearly streaming service you could watch on your smart TV. Thank you so much for watching this, and God bless.